Saturday, October 24th, we are continuing with the flooring project. Every day, little by little, getting closer to finish line. Um, we had to open this area up because it's like um, rotting. And the reason why it was rotting is because it's connected to the um, spa over here. So this is the reason why I want to get rid of the spa because even though Brian got this for me for my birthday many years ago, um, my dad installed it improperly like four or five times and we opened this up and, you know, try to figure out what was going on. Um, because it was leaking every single time my sister used this um, spa, sauna, steam room situation. So it's leaking under there and then it connects to the room on this end. So it affected this and it also affected downstairs. So let me show you guys downstairs. We had to do this like a few times within the past couple of years. Um, so when my sister took a shower in the spa, um, it would leak through there and then come through here. And you can see like the damage right there. You see that line? That's already been like replaced, painted, and it still would leak through. So right now we're trying to just figure out the big problem, like nuke it where it began. You guys see that? Like, this is not gonna be good. So, we have to redo it. Make sure that it's stronger and get the restroom done right for good. I'm at Home Depot right now and going to grab this aisle 9 Bay 13. Let's go. Oh, looks so festive. Okay, let's look for aisle 9, grade 13. Ready! Yeah. And here it is. Bingo! <gasps> well, I thought it was the last one, but... No, it's all the way in there. So, hubby got in a little accident. He dropped a whole box of flooring onto his toesies and now he's injured and in a lot of pain. And Scooper here running around like a maniac. He finished his bowl of mummy, right? Mm, there's a bowl right here next to me, it's empty. Okay. <laughs> Look at this boy. Mm. Uh oh, uh oh, he wants milk. He wants milk. <laughs> Brian made it halfway from that room. <laughs> He's gotta get to this room. Toe's about to explode. Oh, so much pressure. Oh my gosh. So um, I set up some situation for him to come and lay here. He's gotta have his legs or toes elevated along with this huge um, ice thing. So yeah. Come on, honey. You're one fourth way there. <laughs> Let me help him. This is a lesson learned. You gotta wear the proper shoes. <laughs> Gosh. So let's, uh, do you want me to piggyback you? I need to keep my foot elevated. Unless like gonna bust open. Let me show you guys what it looks like. So, um, it's kind of purple there. And then definitely underneath here, that's purple. You, I mean, it's kind of like a shadow. Lift up your leg. Mm -hmm. So we show the bruise. But see, that's actually not shadow. That's actually bruise and swollen. Yeah. Looks like a dead toe. Oh my gosh. So the flooring fell on top, but it smushed his bottom. This is what it was. <laughs> this whole flooring right here fell on his toe. 
And so now he's just dying from the pain. Oh, fruit for you. Fruit? Oh, can you wash this for me? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm gonna try to get him to hop on over here while I uh, elevate his legs. <laughs> I guess he just wants to go. Oh my god. <laughs> it hurts. I know, wait! You just messed up my situation for you! I, I could elevate it on here. Oh my god, it. no. Okay, okay, okay. So he doesn't want it higher because this is good to get the um, foot touching the. Uh, Ice pack. Um, he has to pee though. <laughs> but we'll just wait a little bit. I can put it higher if you want, you know, just put another pillow underneath. Okay. Yeah? Okay. Alright, so I hope that he cures from this quickly so he can, um, you know, get back to his work that he has to go to on Monday, a site walk. He's going to be walking all day underneath a tunnel, so if he doesn't care by then, then he has to cancel that and just stay in bed. Just send someone else. Mm-hmm. So, um, yeah. I mean, he's supposed to shower. Oh. Uh. Because we did, like, you know, use a lot of chemicals that kind of sprayed back at us. Or, you know, I just want him to get out of these clothes because it might be hazardous to smell all that stuff. That mold killer kind of deal. The whole house still kind of smells like super chemical-y. So, let's try to get him out of this clothes before he falls asleep. Alright guys, good night. Thanks for watching and um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hope for better days, Brian. We'll see you. Good night, guys. Can you say good night, Tozy? Can you wiggle it? Wiggle good night, Tozy. No, not today. All right. All right. All right. All right.